Hello everyone, you are welcome to solve this nice exponential equation which is 9 to the power of x minus 9 to the power of x minus 1 this is equal to 36. So what is the value of x? Now let's provide a solution from here. We have 9 to the power of x minus 9 to the power of x minus 1 this is equal to 36. We have that 9 to the power of x minus 1, this is in the form of a to the power of n minus m, which we can express as a to the power of n divided by a to the power of m. Applying this exponent property, then here we have 9 to the power of x minus 9 to the power of x dividing, divided by 9 to the power of 1, this is equal to 36. Now we have 9 to the power of x is common here, so let's factor out 9 to the power of x, so that into the parentheses, here we have 1 minus 1 over 9, cross the parentheses, this is equal to 36. Now, this implies here we have 9 to the power of x into the parentheses. Now, the FCM here is equal to 9. 1 is our whole number, so this is over 1. So 9 divided by 1, this is 9 times 1, this is 9, minus 9 divided by 9, this is 1 times 1, this is 1. Cross the parentheses, this is equal to 36. The next step from here, we have 9 to the power of x into the parentheses, 9 minus 1, this is 8 over 9. Cross the parentheses, this is equal to 36. The next step from here, Let's multiply both signs by 9 over 8. So also let's multiply here by 9 over 8. So by simplifying here, we have that 9 to the power of x, this is equal to 36 times 9 over 8. We can simplify here. 8 divided by 4, this is 2. 36 divided by 4, this is 9. So 9 times 9, this is 81 over 2. The next step, to so solve for x here, we introduce logarithm on both sides. That is from 9 to the power of x. This is equal to log 81 over 2. So log 9 to the power of x, this is in the form of log a to the power n, which we can express as n log a. Now applying this logarithm property from here, or this is property, log 9 to the power of x becomes x log 9. This is equal to log 81 over 2. So let's divide both signs by log 9. Log 9. So the next step is to simplify here. That is log 9 and log 9 simplifies. So that now x is equal to, this is rho 81 over 2, everything here divided by rho 9. We have that rho 81 over 2, this is in the form of rho a over b, which you can express as rho a subtract rho b. Applying this logarithm property from here, so this means that x is equal to log 81 divided by log 9, subtract log 2 divided by log 9. Now the next step from here, we can express 81 as 3 to the power of 4. And we can express 9 as 3 to the power of 2. Substituting this here, we have that x is equal to log 3 to the power of 4 divided by log 3 to the power of 2. Subtract log 2 divided by log 3 to the power of 2. 
applying the power of property from here that states that rho a to the power of n this can be expressed as n rho a now applying this property then we have that x is equal to this is 4 rho 3 divided by 2 rho 3 then subtract rho 2 divided by 2 rho 3 so let's simplify here rho 3 and rho 3 simplifies then 4 divided by 2 this is the same thing as 2 so we have that x is equal to 2 minus half rho 2 divided by rho 3 and define that rho 2 over rho 3 this is in the form of rho a divided by rho b which we can transform as rho a to base b applying this rogatim property then we have that x is equal to 2 minus half rho 2 to base 3 so this is the value of x the next step from here is to verify that this value of x satisfies the equation now if you recall we have that 9 to the power of x subtract 9 to the power of x minus 1 this is supposed to give us the value of 36 we said that 9 to this power x minus 1 this is in the form of a to the power of n minus m which we can express as a to the power of n divided by a to the power of m now let's apply this exponent property from here now applying this exponent property from here we have 9 to the power of x minus 9 to the power of x divided by 9 this is equal to 36 now we have that 9 to the power of x is common here so we factor out 9 to the power of x so that now here we have 1 minus 1 over 9 this is equal to 36 so we have 9 to the power of x times here we have the LCM as 9 1 is a whole number so 9 divided by 1 times 1 that's 9 subtract 9 divided by 9 which is 1 times 1 this is 1 this is equal to 36 the next step is that we have 9 to the power of x times 9 minus 1 this is 8 over 9 this is equal to 36 let's multiply both signs by 9 over 8 by 9 over 8 so if you simplify here we have 9 to the power of x this should be equal to 36 times 9 over 8 well if you see that 6 divided by 4 this is 9 and 8 divided by 4 this is 2 so 9 to power x this should give us a value of 81 over 2 let's substitute the value of x from here we have 9 to the power of 2 minus a half rock 2 to base 3 this is supposed to give us a value of 81 over 2 now 9 this to power 2 minus a half rock 2 to base 3 this is in the form of a to power n minus m which we can transform to a to power n over a to power m so this implies here we have 9 to power 2 divided by 9 this to power half rock 2 to base 3 this should give us a value of 81 over 2 now we can express 9 as 3 to the power of 2 so that now we have here 9 squared remember 9 squared this is equal to 81 so here we have 81 divided by 3 to the power of 2 times half rock 2 to base 3 this should give us a value of 81 over 2 okay so this implies that here 
2 and 2 simplifies so that now we have 81 over 3 raised to the power of 2 to base 3. This is supposed to give us a value of 81 over 2. Now, 3 raised to the power of 2 to base 3. This is actually in the form of 3 raised to the power of 2 to base 3. This is in the form of m raised to the power of a to base m, which is supposed to give us a value of a. So let's apply this logarithm property from here. So 3 raised to the power of 2 to base 3, this is equal to 2. Let's substitute this so that now here we have 81 over 2. This should be equal to 81 over 2. So this implies that the left and side is equal to the right and side. And this implies that the value of x, which is 2 minus a half of 2 to base 3, satisfies the equation. So can you follow the steps? Like this video and subscribe. See you in the next video.